on in the last couple of years. So, uh, oh, Boom. Big, upside big down, upside over down. and over the 83 of Mike Afrano. A big, big wreck coming out of turn number four into the grass. He goes, another car sliding by. That's James Hilton in the 48 car. Rolling numerous times, the 83 of Mike Afrano. That was one of the more vicious wrecks I've seen in a while here at, at Talladega. And on its side now as the caution has come out. See the air cleaner laying right here on the infield grass. So the safety crews will immediately get out to that race car and driver. We're seeing him come to the car right now. It doesn't look like there's a, a right rear tire. I don't know if maybe it, it went down or it came off during the... It looked like it crash. came off in the, in the flips in the that it was doing, or the tumbling that it was doing. And maybe just the inner liner that's left. See a lot of debris here. Yeah, These guys the are really right going to have to be careful. We'll see if the uh, ARCA Racing officials may send these guys down pit road, yeah, possibly. Sometimes, sometimes when there's a lot of debris on the racetrack, they'll take the pace car down pit road. And it's pretty much all the way across. They are going to take them down pit road. I think that's a great move by the officials. Give them a given up. There's the carcass of the tire right there by the ambulance that we were talking about off the right rear of that car. This is a situation where the safety crews will immediately attend to the driver, make sure the driver's okay before they think about rolling that car over. They actually practice rolling cars in the middle of our screen there. He may get a little contact from behind. He gets a little contact from behind. Is that Zach Ralston behind him and just turns him in towards the outside wall? You see the tire carcass flying out. Let's watch that engine there. You see the slam down to the ground. Now the engine's already pretty much loose. There's the spring sliding out around the racetrack. There's that fire we talk about, but it was immediately this is, extinguished. This is Zach Ralston the night. He makes kind of lifts the back end of that car up, turns it into the outside wall. He already starts tumbling about the time and hit that outside wall. It looked like the two guys in front of him there, we were talking about real estate earlier, got a little bit too close. And, uh, you know, he, he may have lifted ever so slightly. When you do that, the guy hits you from behind. Obviously, once the rear tires are off the ground, you're not... You, you, any movement on that wheel is, is going to turn you that direction and unfortunately turn him head on into the outside wall and over he went. And remember, it's the landings that are flying <laughs> out. Yeah. yeah, flying through the air, I, I do that. Yeah. It's, it's wow. That, yeah. Look how high that tire got up yeah. above the car. He's probably glad this is one ride in his life that's over. I mean, it, it, you yeah. know, when it's all said and done, um, you don't see many like that anymore. And that. That Let's was take, really safe. We're going to take a look at Ready it safe. at about 200 miles an hour here. It looked like the, when he got turned into the outside wall, the left front tire dug in before he even got to the wall. Six and a half tumbles for Mike Afrano. Yeah, I mean, if you hear Zach, he's checking up as yeah. soon as he's hitting him. Yeah. So. I mean, obviously he's trying, but it...